Well, San Antonio is the Alamo City's technology campus. More than 13,000 people on property generating over $5 billion. But Port SA is so much more than just a place of work. It's a place of innovation and education. Max Massey visited the San Antonio Museum of Science and Technology to get a first-hand look at the new cybersecurity simulator. Hey guys, we are here at Sam Sethi Museum at Port SA and I'm looking at something very cool. The first personal computer designed right here in San Antonio in 1970 and we are joined by David Monroe of the museum. So David, what exactly are we looking at right now? Why is this so important? This is the first desktop computer that was ever built. But prior to this time, computers either filled big rooms, mainframe computers, or they were mini computers in racks. But this incorporated all of the, the uh, technology, the processor, screen, keyboard, in one package that would sit on your desk. So from going from the past to going to the present, right here, this is amazing to see. What are these, four 75-inch screens, and you were telling me it's called a SOC? Yes, Special Operations Center. This is our simulated cyber Special Operations Center. And what we're doing here is showing the public what, what threats are to the networks, uh, what, what the reactions or the effects of hacking into the networks uh, can cause on daily life. It can cause problems with your bank accounts, your electric power, or your refrigerator. So what we're looking at right there, it's see local time, but you also see things going from country to country, fire eye cyber threat map. Can you explain, this is real time? Correct, this is real data. These are attacks that are being uh, levied against different networks in different countries. There are different kinds of attacks, so they're color-coded based on the type of attack that they, they are. All right, so David, why is this important? Why should people care about this? Several reasons. Well, again, one, one is you need to be aware of the threats that these hackers and the, these cyber attacks can have on you and your personal life. So you need to protect your own computers, your own networks, your own appliances in your, in your home. Secondly, there are national level threats that can threaten our national infrastructure and, and DOD, and we should appreciate those threats and that our governments are working to protect us in those areas. Third, thirdly, there are a lot of jobs in the area of cybersecurity, and a lot of those are in San Antonio, and we like to introduce those opportunities to children and young adults so they can study it and, and become involved in these jobs. Perfect, David. All right, thank you so much. Really appreciate your time. Thank you. All right, guys, this is just one of the many stories we are doing here at Port SA throughout the week. Back to you.